hey NFL crew. The adrenaline's pumping cause the showdown's near. Steelers vs. Cardinals promises tons of thrill. The model's predicting, but it's the players' passion and grit that'll set this game on fire. The Cardinals have struggled away, losing 10 in a row. Meanwhile, the Steelers are climbing, boasting a powerhouse defense and a sharper offense post changes. Here's the deal, numbers are cool, but the hunger for victory decides it. Cardinals craving that turnaround, but the Steelers? They're sharp and ready to take on anything. This battle's gonna be electrifying. So, folks, what do you reckon? Stats give a hint, but the game's unpredictable, jam-packed with excitement. Who's taking this one? Will the Cardinals break that away game curse or will the Steelers show they're geared up to shine? Tell us who's owning this epic showdown. Breaking news from the NFL. Steelers defensive force Damon Tekazi faces yet another fine, marking his fifth this season and tallying over $50,000 in penalties. This isn't just about dollars, it's about the passion and intensity on the field. Pittsburgh Steelers safety Damon Tekazi is feeling the heat after the NFL slapped him with the $11,806 fine for an unnecessary roughness penalty during Week 12 against the Cincinnati Bengals. The hit, which occurred early in the game against Bengals tight end Er Smith Jr., raised eyebrows as Kazi seemingly lowered his helmet, although it went unnoticed during the play. Kazi isn't alone in the penalty box. He joins eight other players who faced fines in Week 12, adding to the Steelers' cumulative fines for the season. This year alone, the safety has racked up a total of $59,030 in penalties, all five fines being a substantial $11,806 each. The Steelers' fines have piled up this season, nearing a staggering $400,000, with running back Jalen Warren leading the charge with over $97,000 in penalties. Kazi sits as the third most fine player on the team, following closely behind linebacker Quan Alexander, who faced a hefty fine of $87,418. This isn't just about dollars and cents, it's about the game's intensity and the dedication of these players. What's your take on this, folks? Do you think these fines are fair game, or are they excessive considering the nature of the plays? Jump in and share your thoughts on this fiery topic in the NFL.